Now what do we have here? Yeah, that's uh, that's my dog tracks. He's leading us to Dog Man right now. So we're just gonna keep following these. This should bring us to uh, Dog Man's dwelling. And then it's on. It's on. Dog tracks have uh, disappeared a little bit. It makes me a little suspicious. I don't know. They sort of vanished in thin air back there. But that's uh, that's Dogman's dwelling up here. Might have uh, flying abilities. You never know. Yeah, it could fly. He's been known to levitate. Thus, no uh, no dog tracks could call him that levitation. It could, it, it could be a, a nuclear side effect, possibly. It could, it could be. No one knows. Scientists have decided not even to try and solve it. No, because uh, scientists, uh, if they can't prove it, it doesn't exist. What do they know? Bullshit. Next thing you know, like leprechauns aren't real. Give me a break. Exactly. So, uh, treat boy here has got the flashlight. We're gonna try to lure him out with some treats. You got some treats? Did you bring the dog treats? Yeah. That was basically your job. So you didn't bring the dog treats? Hmm. Okay. Uh, what, what was his mission on this? Well, I, I, you know what? Maybe you are the dog treat. Go get him, decoy. Here we go. If you don't bring the treats, you are the treat. If a dog man comes at you, shine a light in his eyes. He's a, uh, the owls have that uh, vision thing at the night. Uh, noctur he's nocturnal. Noculitis. See these? Classic. Get the stalactites, stalagmites, tights, mites. Oh, he's gonna mix up dog man. See the moss here? You got the moss. What happens is he gets the nutrients from the stalagmite or stalactite, whichever it is. I don't know which one goes up, which one comes down. But he gets the nutrients. He get it falls down the icicle here, and he gets his water and his nutrients all at once. Because as you can see, it's pretty barren land around here, and it's hard to get nutrients. So this is how he survives in the cave. <laughs> okay, don't knock down Dogman's food, please. Okay. Dogman. Now a lot of people will tell you, never enter a cave in the winter. I agree with them. That's why we sent Treatsy. This here, it's like a, like a caveman when they fashion tools. He thought this was food. As you can see, there's burn marks on here and he tried to make this into like a uh, sausage. But then obviously he realized it's plastic. Dogman's not too bright, but he uh, he's resourceful. He's resourceful. Are we at the end? Well, dog man sometimes disguises the walls. Like false walls. What? Jesus Christ. Fuck. What was that? What was that? I don't know, we had a little disturbance madness there. Some of the uh, stalactites fell down. Is it possible they were stalagmites though? The stalactites maybe. But it fell. There's something hanging from the roof here. Yeah, that's a big fucking bat. Or dogman spawn. Dogman spawn. He's spawning. We decided to leave the cave and tread very carefully, not to give Dogman any indication that we were in his dwelling. Jesus Christ, man. Okay, so we found a bat. There was no sign of Dogman other than all the signs of Dogman. You know what I mean? Definite signs. So basically Dogman's not home or Dogman's got some action on the side and he hasn't woken up yet after a busy holiday night. Do you know what I mean? Or he's out uh, killing, killing the innocent, because that's what Dogman does. We'll get him. But, Dogman, now you know we know that you know that we know where you live, so t take that with you when you leave. BAM! Did you just hear a dog bark? Yes. <coughs>
Man, a few words, Treatsy. With all the treats. Nice nickname. I heard it though. It's probably my dog. He's on the track. That's probably why the levitation thing maybe didn't happen. I don't know. Dog tracks probably went that way. We'll find him. We'll find him. We decided to proceed on foot and maintain total silence in an effort to keep Dogman from stalking us while we stalked him, while he stalked us. But we're still stalking him. It's deadly. The forest can be a scary place, and every little noise, every little chirp, every little bird singing tweet, tweet, tweet freaked us out a little bit. But that's what you get when you're a monster hunter. Now normally, being out in the bush like this, it's a good idea to bring a compass. But Dogman doesn't have a compass. Therefore, we don't have a compass. We can, two can play that game. Woof, woof. And I know where we are. You know where we are? Yeah, I, so we're, in, we're in the backyard here. Oh, okay, that, that's good. Yeah. Good. Now what about, whoa, whoa, we, we got something here, we folks. Got tracks. Yeah, looks like he backtracked. There's our uh, marks coming in. We got the dog tracks here backtracking. Leads me to believe Dogman was watching us when we came in. He waited till we went by and go to his uh, dwelling. Then he made a beeline possibly for these log piles over here. He likes to hide in the log piles. He got snakes, uh, snails, stuff to eat. Good hiding spot too. It would appear the hunter has become the hunted. We've seen other Dogman footage. The footage the scientists have said there's no question that we don't know what the hell is going on. What do we think of that footage? We know what's going on. It's conspiracy. Go on. They know of Dogman. I know they know of Dogman. They got laboratories. They got Area 55, Area 51. 55 is the brother site of Area 51. That's where they keep things like Dogman, the Yeti, the Leprechaun, Sasquatch. Is there a chance Ogopogo is there? Ogopogo, the legendary Ogopogo, which also uh, is from the realm of Northern Ontario. There's a lot of mythical creatures in the Northern Ontario, and uh, Ogopogo is one of them. He's uh, Nessie's distance cousin. Thrives in uh, freshwater sites, swamp, beaver dams. Right, Treatsy? Definitely. <laughs>